New drone video captures the scene of Saturday's deadly limo crash in Schoharie, New York. All 18 people inside the limo and two pedestrians were killed. Certainly it does appear from the physical evidence that somebody ran through that stop sign, but we want to understand why that happened. Police say the 2001 Ford Excursion limo was traveling on State Route 30 when it went across the intersection. It plowed straight into a parking lot outside the Apple Barrel Country Store, hitting two pedestrians and slamming into an empty SUV before careening into a ditch. The NTSB says it will look into prior crashes at this location as part of its investigation. Locals say this intersection is a dangerous spot. Two tractor trailers have gone down the hill before and actually have come across the parking lot into the field in the back here um, during sore hours when somebody could have been killed. Four sisters are among the victims. You can't wrap your head around it. You just can't. Barbara Douglas says her nieces were going to a winery to celebrate the youngest sister, Amy Steenberg's 30th birthday. They were very close to each other and they loved their family. Amy Steenberg's husband, Axel, was also killed in the crash, as was Axel's brother, Rich Steenberg. Their younger brother, Eric, says the tragedy hasn't sunk in yet. They were really um, good brothers, I'll tell you. They were always there for me. Anytime I needed anything, they were always there. They always had my back for everything. The victims leave behind at least three young children. Wendy Gillette, CBS News, Schoharie, New York. Now, CBS has also learned the limo company had four vehicles taken off the road after inspections over the last 24 months.